conceded fourth in the competition. This robot isn't to be taken lightly. It's shaped like a kind of domed wedge. Unseeded this robot. It's showing a lot of potential. Powered by a five horsepower, four stroke petrol engine. It's armed with a lawnmower blade powered by a two stroke petrol engine. This robot's seeded seventh in the competition should pose a genuine challenge, armoured in polycarbonate. They better mind the arena wall flamers, they can be very, very dangerous. Three, two, one, activate! Sergeant wants a taste of metal. On a tremendous charge now, speeding across the arena. Can the aluminium armor stand up to this? Polycarbonate, not such good defense against cutting attacks. Oh, look out! Could be barbecue pot! The lawnmower blades just raising the surface. Mind the paper. Not too difficult to cut into the Kevlar armor with the right weapon. The cutting attack doing its best to get through the bulletproof glass. Not too hard to cut into the aluminium, but it's putting up a great fight. The Kevlar taking a battering, but holding up. The blades grind round, trying to get into a good position to attack. The blades grind in. Only superficial damage that time. Trying hard to cut through the Kevlar. Not sure how long the aluminium armor can hold up against this sort of impact. Trying to cut its way through the polycarbonate. Battering away at the Kevlar, but it's ideal to resist it. The steel armor getting its some defense against the attack. The deadly flywheel on the attack again. This is classic robot wars. The Kevlar, not the toughest armor against blades like this. The aluminium armor, not much defense against this kind of attack. Lifting it just enough for it to fall over. Not much damage though. The Kevlar armor giving it great protection though. Some damage, that'll help. It crashes in and that's gonna hurt. Not easy to smash through that polycarbonate shell. The aluminium shell, very flimsy protection against this onslaught. Can the aluminium armor stand up to this? It smashes in, but standing up fairly well to this battery. Wouldn't like to be cleaning the debris from the arena later on. Careful, don't drive into the pit. There's no way out of there. The crowd are waiting for something to happen here. Bits and pieces everywhere. We could melt them down, I suppose, and make a whole new robot out of them. Onto the arena flipper they go! Are they ready to fly? Not sure how long the aluminium armor can hold up against this sort of impact. Metal everywhere! And the crowd love it. And some serious damage with that blow! Very good charge from this robot! This has all the makings of a classic battle. It's finding it hard to stand up to a slicing with just the aluminium armor. The aluminium armor, not much defense against this kind of attack. It's made a good start. It's beginning to cause some damage. That flip was ready and waiting for its first victim. Hard to make an impression on the polycarbonate. It's very tough. Coming in for an attack with a flamethrower. The aluminium shell. Very flimsy protection against this onslaught. Dents and scrapes as it bumps and barges around the arena. They can't right themselves here. I'm afraid it's game over. The Kevlar armor can get great protection though. The steel armor can get some protection from the impact. Oh! Uh, Taking a bit of a battery as it pushes it all over yeah. and tries to top on it. Cease! I'm not surprised I have no control.
Ja. Great protection though. 
Not too difficult to cut into the Kevlar armor with the right weapon. Coming in to pin it down with the ideal pushing weapon there. It's carnage! Devastation! It's robot wars! I'm not sure how long the aluminium armor can hold up against this sort of impact. The Kevlar taking a battering but holding up. The crowd are waiting for something to happen here. Keep away from the pit! Unless you've had enough of this fight. Very highly rated robot this one, it's seeded second, powered by a three horsepower two stroke petrol engine. It's armed with a huge 22 tons of crushing power from those jaws of life. Three, two, one, activate. 
Sergeant Bash is waiting to cook. Who's the main course? Onto the arena pipper they go. Are they ready to fly? The yeah. aluminium shell, very flimsy protection against this onshore. Doing their best to push it against any obstacle they can find. Nothing damaging it so far. Grating away and a little damage appearing. The chainsaw skimming off the surface. Not even a scratch. Can the aluminium armor stand up to this? That's encouraging. There's some damage showing. Can they follow it up now? They can't hide themselves. Something's wrong. It looks like they're out of the contest. The chainsaw clatters off the surface. Not strong enough to get through it, I think. Heading over to push and tip it if it can. Not too hard to cut into the aluminium, but it's putting up a brave fight. This is classic robot wars. Using the CPZ. Cease! Yay. Credits, I can get my stuff in there. Sure. Bloody triangle on this button there. It don't work on that controller, so I'll swap controller and stick it off this menu. He might do stand up to me. Definitely in with a chance of surprising everyone, this robot unseated today. Armoured in steel and very resilient to being cut or burnt. This is the sixth seed. Could be one to watch out for. Armoured in Kevlar, difficult to pierce this material. Unseeded in this competition, but could have a few surprises up its sleeve. A five horsepower, four stroke petrol engine, giving this robot all the power it needs. The flamers on the arena walls can be a great danger if a robot's flammable at all. They can give them a nasty shock, even if they aren't, too. Three. Two, one, activate! Bash is ready and waiting, standing to attention with the flamethrower just itching to flame away. The steel armor giving it some protection for the advantage. What do you think of it? Cut into the Kevlar armor with the white right paper. Not enough to damage it, even with the sword blade. It's garnished! Devastation! 
Soviet Russia and build and build and build and we make them stronger to beat them. I've been smoking so I shouldn't be. <laughs> Three, two, one, activate! Just be telling you. Yeah. <laughs> oh! Look out! Could be barbecue bots! Away. 
All right. The main arena feature is the drill tower. Makes a great spot to push robots into and let the drill do the work for you. Three, two, one. Activate! The crowd getting restless, waiting for them to get going. I think Dead Metal's waiting to carve up another contender. Tough steel armor, making it harder to cut into a fork. The titanium stands up well to the punishment. No sign of damage yet. Standing up well to the chainsaw attack. And Shanxi 
is his chance, here he goes! Titanium won't be able to stand up to too much of that. Reese singing on the attack, can they lift it though? The crowd are wondering what's happened here, this isn't what they came to see, they want maiming and slaughter. Look out for Dead Metal's claws, or it could be curtains! So boring, but I actually can move. Trying hard to cut through the Kevlar. Not as much damage as I expect to see. Such will toughen up. The steel resisting the blade so far. All I can do is spin in a circle. That is it. There is no movement whatsoever. Blades like this. The armor holding out well against the charge. The titanium standing up for now. Long will it hold out? The steel armor giving it some defense against the attack. Pushing with some force there as it drives it back. The blade thuds in and rips the shell a little. The chainsaw blade looking ferocious as it darts in for an attack. The Kevlar giving it great protection though. And even the powerful circular saw having trouble getting through this one. Not a lot happening here. The crowd want more action. The chainsaw coming in for an attack. Saw blade whirring as they try to find an opening. They can't write themselves. Something's wrong. It looks like they're out of the contest. This has all the makings of a classic battle. Tough steel armor, making it harder to cut into, of course. This is what Robot Wars is all about. Carnage. On the attack now. Some of the... Cease. Okay, so we're no movement whatsoever. I've qualified. <laughs> so if we can find a problem. It would help if they actually destroyed the problem. <laughs> Devastation! 
It's Robot Wars! The titanium standing up for now. How long will it hold out? In it comes! Can it get under there? The chainsaw tearing away, but it's only grazing and scratching so far. Need to get a better grip. Coming in for an attack with the vicious looking saw blade. Racing in on the attack. Can they lift it though? It's made a good start. It's beginning to cause some damage. Buzzing closer. The chainsaw looking for an opportunity to see some action. The Kevlar taking a battering but holding up. The titanium won't be able to stand up too much of that. Slicing away. Minimal damage that time though. Barging in to push it around. Look out for dead metal's claws or it could... And on out. Cease! Yeah. Right, let's have a pace of water. Let's see what's missing. Credits. No, not 5,000. 500 credits. Hi again, Roboteer. There's some excellent parts in the shop just waiting to be purchased. All right. There's a drill tower in this arena that can make short work of a robot if it's pushed under there. Three, two, one. Activate! The crowd getting restless, waiting for them to get going. In comes that heavy blade now! Pushing and shoving. Need something to push into it hard oh, to do any damage. It's going to be tough getting through the bulletproof glass on there. Coming in to pin it down with the ideal pushing weapon. Smashing down with that mighty axe blade. The Kevlar, not the toughest armor against blades like this. The Kevlar armor can be great protection work. The cutting attack, doing its best to get through the bulletproof glass. Doing their best to push it against any obstacle they can find. Nothing damaging it so far. A mighty clunk as it makes contact. It's deeper than it looks. Only a few scratches this time.
three, two, one, activate. The crowd are waiting for something to happen here. The Kevlar taking a battering but holding up. Not easy to smash through that polycarbonate shell. And that's it, causing damage as it starts to rip into it. It's heading for a collision. This has all the makings of a classic battle. That won't lift anything anymore. The polycarbonate, not such good defense against cutting attacks. Not a lot happening here. The crowd want more action on a direct collision course. This is what Robot Wars is all about. Carnage. Tremendous force behind that charge. You can see the huge dents the impact made. The cutting attack doing its best to get through the bulletproof glass. And it's going to barge straight into it. Not a lot of damage so far. Not too 
very difficult to cut into the Kevlar armor with the right weapon. The steel armor giving it some protection from the impact. The weapon trying to lift it and topple it. Already a puncture mark as the spike gets stuck in. Nothing serious. Cease! Oh, well, anyway. 